Hey, this is Brian Jones from eLearning Art bringing you one of many PowerPoint design treatment tutorials available in the eLearning Art library. In this video, I'll show you how to use PowerPoint to apply a graphic novel effect to a photo like this. Then in a follow-up, I'll show you how to create the panels in your slides. Check out the show notes for links to the source files and cheat sheets so you can do a three-click shortcut to apply the same changes. For example, with the source files, you'll be able to just one, two, three, and have the graphic novel style applied to your photo. Let's go ahead and get started. Today we're going to create the graphic novel style in PowerPoint. Let's style some e-learning art characters to fit into the graphic novel design treatment. Your characters will start like this, but when you're done, they'll look like this. Let's get started. Style your first image. Insert the image into your PowerPoint file. Right-click the image. From the drop-down menu, select Format Picture. In the Format Picture panel, click the Picture icon. Open the Picture Color dialog. Click the Recolor icon. Click Black and White 50%. In the Format Picture panel, click on the Effects icon. Open the Glow dialog. Set color to black. Set size to three points for this image. If your image is larger or smaller, you may have to adjust this. Leave the transparency at 0%. Your character is now styled in the graphic novel style. Now let's duplicate the style to another image. Insert the new image into your PowerPoint file. Click on the styled image. On the home ribbon, click Format Painter. Click on the new image. It will automatically be styled to match. You've now transferred the style from one to the other. Now let's duplicate the style to multiple images. Insert all new images into your PowerPoint file and get them ready. Click on the styled image. On the home ribbon, double click Format Painter. Click on each of the new images. They'll automatically be styled to match. To close the Format Painter tool, click the Escape key on your keyboard. You've now copied the style to multiple characters. Okay, guys, it's just that simple. Remember, you can download all the source files and cheat sheets for this tutorial right there in the show notes so you can do that three click step process and in the next tutorial i'll show you how to create the graphic novel panels in your slides